Here's the quickest way to install Hammer++ for Gmod. So first of all, you want to go to Steam, you want to go to your library, and you want to go to this section and select Tools. Then you want to find Source SDK based 2013 multiplayer and install it. Once done, download the application in the description and open it. When you open it, you want to go to Tools, install Hammer++, click Automatic Selection, click OK, then click Begin Download. Once the download is finished, click OK, Hammer++ will open, select any profile you want, click OK, and then close the program. Next, you want to click Next, then you want to add profile, click Automatic Installation Detection, and then click any game you want. I'm going to choose Gary's Mod. So once Gary's Mod is added, we want to go to Edit Mount Sources. Now obviously Gmod Maps use Gmod based assets, but they sometimes use custom assets such as TF2 or CSS. So what we want to do is that we want to add a folder to the CSS folder, specifically the Counter-Strike Source folder, so CSS, C Strike, Open, and then Add VPKs in Folder, Counter-Strike Source, C Strike, Open. Once done, click Close, then open Hammer++, go to Gary's Mod, Open, File, Open. Additionally, if you've got a lot of FGD files in your uh, game directory, you want to go to Tools, Options, and then make sure you remove them and only have Base, Gary's Mod, and Gmod. This is a custom one I use, it's part proper, but don't worry. But you might want to remove any unwanted FGD files, because otherwise they may clash with one another. Right, once you've opened your map, go to File, Run Map and go to expert never use this menu only use expert now when you want to compile a map you want to use a specific profile which has exclamation mark hammer plus plus so choose a profile that you want so you've got many different profiles you've got fast which is used for debugging simple stuff you've got normal which is just the normal compile stuff and then final compile which is the compilation profile you should use when you're releasing your map so i'm personally going to use mine which is automatically included you want to click go and wait. As you can see the map is fully compiled and it's got lighting on all the Counter-Strike source textures. I hope you enjoyed.